Hi everybody. Today I'm doing an Engage. Um, Engage. Gaggling colliery pit head. No, I haven't actually got an Engage layout. So I thought I'd let my partner build this. See how easy it is. So we've got it all laid out and uh, we'll go on from then. Right, so here she goes. First time she's ever built a model of. I've missed a bit. She's going to get all the bits out and lay them out. We'll get them laid out and then we'll come back to you. <coughs> right, she's got all the bits. First thing she's going to do is the wheels. Now? Yeah. Just follow the diagram. Don't need a lot. It's stuck. Right, she's just put some PBA glue around the edges and putting the little wheel. It's got to be inside the big wheel. It is. Then you've got to stick another big wheel on top of that. So I'm better off gluing the wheel, aren't I? Mm. Right, what she's doing now is that the wheel is actually there's three, there's a rim and two wheels. The rim on the inside is slightly smaller. This is so uh, if you want to put a rope up, it will hang on. Okay. That looks good. Next one. Right, that's the second wheel. She's just pushing the inner ring it, rim in. So if you want to put a like a wire rope on these, you can actually do that. Set. So take, turn the page of you. So you've done. So you've done that look. bit. That's how it should look. Yeah. So next part is the tower by the looks of it. Well, you've got to stick those. So you can see the windows on the, the grates. So those go into those. Like that? No, you've got to put the windows down here. Look. Oh. All what, these, these? The grates. Yeah. First? Yeah. Okay. So these, there looks like there's a cleaner side and a dirty side. Do you want the clean side or the dirty side? Showing. Showing. The dirty side. Right. Well, these shouldn't take too long, should they? Right, we'll leave it to stick all the uh, grates in. Right, so that's the two uh, sides to the tower, though. Turn over the instructions. Next part is to join them all together and put the top on. If you do them like that, look, in two halves, then join the two halves together, you'll get them square. Okay. Is it better to glue both pieces, or just one? Just one, yeah. You don't need to do the outside of the teeth, it's inside where the glue Yeah, I've done the inside. It. 
I would lay it flat and then put it up to it, that's it. Well, if I'm doing it like that, I'm better off, to me, holding it like that and then gluing it from the inside. Okay, which is ever easier. I've just got to rest that one so that's it. Right, that's a two halves done then. So if you glue them together... And you want the small window at the top. Please. That's the uh, two sides glued, a nice degrees hopefully. A new use for dishwasher tablets. So we'll let them dry and then we'll try and join the towel together. Right, there we are. She's glued the tower together, just a matter of putting the top on there. Now you've got to make sure the holes are opposite the windows. Opposite the window? Oh, one way around then. Well, I don't think I've glued it fine to the edge. Perhaps I'm better off gluing that. Why do the holes have to be opposite the windows? Well, I don't know, it's just the way it is on the diagram. It's the way the wheels fit on it, or the way the ropes go, they won't be lined up with the wheels. There we go. Yeah, that's it. Right, that's the tower done. So now um, she's starting to uh, join the four pieces of the main tower together. We've done it so that the square bits at the bottom, haven't we? Yeah. So I've, um, well, I haven't, she has. Built the tower, and now she's putting the top on. The brackets have picked, <coughs> excuse me, the brackets have picked the wheels on. Right, so that's the uh, top bracket for the wheel made. We'll just let that go off and then we'll uh, put the axle through and put the wheels on. Right, so she's bent the wheels now. It's like a biscuit. I can't see where the hole is. Got it. I think. What's that? Is that in? I think so, yeah. It's just trying to get it through now. Yeah, it's through. It's got to get it through that. 
bracket thing, whatever you called it. That's it, that's true. That's it then. To fit the uh, wheels in, we did have to actually cut away a little bit the one of the cross members. Yeah. So that's both the wheels in. You can see where that cross one has been cut away. And they move. Right, so now she's just building the top of the tower. That which goes is over the wheels. Framework for the top of the wheels. So while uh, we wait for that bit to dry, she's just putting the angle brackets on the sport girders. Is that right? Right, Blue Peter. <laughs> Here's what I did earlier. Yeah. That's it, and then that goes. On there? Eventually. Okay, I'll let that dry. Uh, no, you've got one upside down, look. Oh, yeah, have I? You've got one. Oh, I have. I've got one more and one the other. No, that one's right. Are you sure? Yeah, long side on the... That one's on there. That way. Yeah. While everything's just drying, we're just working out where the ladders and the uh, safety fences go. So that goes on there. glue the ladder onto that. Lovely, that's it first. Just gonna get it under that bracket. It's under on that side. Watch your ladder, you just squash your ladder. I know, I'll just squash my ladder now. It's under now. That's it. That's it, isn't it? So that's on. And the ladder's still on. So now you've got to stick this. Stick this. No, there's a main support on. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. That's right. 
Open it. Yeah. Okay. Put it set. So there we have it. That's the Gagling Colliery Pit Head finish. Thanks to my better half. It took us about an hour and a half to build. If you look at the top, the detailing is quite good. On the wheel. So there you go, that's the end gauge gaggling. I think that would uh, look good on any layout. Okay, that's great. Thanks for watching. That's it. I have to get an engaged layout now. Hi everybody, today we're building this N-Gage Gadling Colliery Pit Head. Well, I'm not actually going to build it. I'm going to get somebody else. Uh, uh, this is on our website, if you look at modlux.store. There's an OO as well, so uh, it, it can go in many places. Anyway, we'll get on with the build and show you exactly how we built it.